Scientists have found the evidence part of Venus surface move around like the pieces of continent on Earth. And while this activity is probably not driven by plate tectonics as on the Earth, it could be a cousin of that process. The findings fit an emerging picture of the planet very much alive in contrast to the traditional view of Venus. Europe is launching a spacecraft Envision to radar map and gather the spectroscopic measurements of the planet's surface and atmosphere. And NASA is sending two craft, Veritas and Da Vinci, to Venus towards the end of this decade. The lead author of Paul by an associate professor of planetary science at North Carolina said that they have identified a previously unrecognized pattern of tectonic deformation on Venus. Although different from the tectonics we currently see on the Earth, it is still the evidence of interior motion being expressed at the planet's surface. So even NASA has announced two missions to Venus and Europe will join the space party at planet Venus. Scientists from Royal Holloway University of London detected the sign blocks of rocky crust in Venus lowland region and rotated and moved laterally related to one another. They compare the apparently relatively recent activity to the way of fragments pack ice jostle around the sea in Earth's polar regions. The principal from European Space Agency's Envision mission, Richard Kale, said that this research shows that we have a lot to learn from Venus and that is there is much wider spectrum of surface mobility than just plate tectonics. Traditionally, Venus lithosphere, its rocky outer layer, was thought to be in one continuous piece in contrast to the Earth, which is broken up into a mosaic of mobile tectonic plates. The Moon, Mars and Mercury are also thought to have static lithospheres, but the findings suggest that Venus lithosphere actually has some degree of mobility though nowhere near as much as Earth's. The results of computer models show molten rock magma rolling beneath the crust could produce the strain, fracturing and distortion seen in Magellan region's images of the surface. So Venus tectonic activity might resemble that on early Earth during an Archean eon between 4 billion and 2.5 billion years ago when the heat flow within the planet was higher and the lithosphere thinner.